Hello, and welcome to the first Upset PC video guide. Today we are going to increase the speed of your Windows XP computer by stopping lots of applications um, which you don't really want running from starting when you start up your computer. For instance, if you're having the problem where when you open your computer you have a huge taskbar with many different items and your computer takes a very long time to load, this is the video you want to follow. Right, so the first step is clicking the start button, clicking run, and when the box opens up, typing msconfig and hitting OK. If you don't see run in this first menu, you can instead use the Windows key and hit R and this window will pop up. Once it is open, click the Startup tab. Now, everything in this list starts up when the computer starts up. As you can see, there is a lot here and a lot of it isn't actually needed. For instance, this is Adobe Reader, which I don't care about when I start my computer. I have no idea what these are, so they can go to. This doesn't look important. This doesn't either, or in fact any of this. Uh, I want MSN to stay on, because that's what I like to start with the computer. But the rest can go by taking the check out of the box. Now it's important to remember that there may be some programs you recognize or want to start with the computer at startup. If this is the case, for instance, if you saw MSN and thought, no, I like that starting with the computer, just leave the green tick in the box. Remember, removing things from this list doesn't remove the software, it simply stops them from opening with the computer. So by removing everything which can possibly open with the computer, you will be starting it much faster and you can start your software as normal by going Start, Programs and navigating around here instead of them starting with the computer, which may be resourcefully wasteful. Right, so I've chosen what I want to do now and what I want to get rid of. What you want to do is click Apply and then close. The computer will prompt you for a restart. You should really click restart here but it doesn't particularly matter. Next time you restart a window will pop up telling you you've made changes to your system configuration. You can quite safely tell that to go away because you just don't mind and you know that you've made those changes. Now your computer should start and run a lot quicker from now on. If you decide you want to put stuff back simply go start, run, msconfig, click OK, in the window that pops up click start up and put a check back in all the boxes which you took it out from and everything will return to normal. You cannot really go wrong. Thank you for watching the first video guide for increasing the speed of Windows XP. If you have any problems please visit, please visit www.upsetpc.com or email support at upsetpc.com. Thank you very much. Bye.